Shalom and welcome to JewishTV.media. Today's topic is hunting and fishing in Jewish law. And this is the question that I've received. Dear Rabbi, you have mentioned in a number of your answers that hunting is a, as a sport is not permitted by Judaism. I understand that fishing is. What is the difference? A fisherman from Rose Bay. So this is what answered the fisherman from Rose Bay that in order to understand the difference between hunting and fishing, we have to have a, a very short synopsis on the laws of kashrut, on the kosher laws, which will show a very big difference between animals and birds and fish. According to Jewish law, the, the, the Torah tells us which animals are kosher. And animals, both domesticated and not domesticated, in order to be kosher, they have to have two signs. They have to have split hoofs and chew the cud. Only a few species have both signs. If an animal has no signs, only one sign, then it is not kosher. There's only four animals that have one sign, among them a pig and a camel, and the vast majority of animals have no signs at all. Lions, tigers and the like. When it comes to birds, the Torah tells us which birds are non-kosher and which are kosher. But when, when it comes to fish, the fish has to have two signs, fins and scales. But there's another major difference. In order, even after the animal and the bird is kosher, they have to be what's called shecht, they have to be slaughtered according to Jewish law. And after they're being slaughtered, they have to be kosher, um, they have to be soaked and salted to be able to get rid of all the blood, excess blood. And only then, when it's done in a prepared in an expert fashion, then the animal becomes suitable to be eaten. Fish is very different. Fish doesn't need to be prepared in any such way, neither by slaughtering nor by cashering. And therefore, when a person goes to fish, he can just catch the fish and immediately afterwards he can prepare and eat it. And now you can see a very major difference. When a person is going hunting, the only benefit that he will have from it is his own fun and, he, and there is an element of cruelty to the animal. He will kill the animal for no benefit to himself. And therefore, the Torah says that to hunt just for fun is not allowed. But fishing, even if it's also fun and hobby, nevertheless, it also has other benefits for human being. And therefore, a person can both enjoy it and have benefit from it. Thank you very much. Have a very good day. And see you again at JewishTV.media. Jewish TV dot media.